This is ridiculous. You can't live in my house with my dad and my family. Your dad got me super clean in the tub. Joe's right. This is idiotic. What are you thinking? I'll tell you what I'm thinking. I'm thinking that I've had two dads, and neither one cared for me as much as Bud does. Peter, I've had enough of this. You can't just take my dad. Well, he's right next door. Nothing's stopping you from going over there and telling him the truth. That his son is a paraplegic who's stuck in a wheelchair. You know I can't do that. Well, suit yourself. But I gotta go. Me and Bud are having a blast. I'm sorry, Joe. A are you okay? Not really. I'll be honest, Lois. This hurts. Hurts like the dickens. I finished my latest novel. Splendid, Charles. What is it called? Oliver Nipple Twist. Ow! Oh, Charles, you bastard! Yeah, the dickens. It hurts like the me. Hey, Dad, what do you say we go play catch? And throw me some divers. I want to get grass stains on my school slacks. What? You're a grown man. I know. It's just so great having a dad. Well, it's nice having reconnected with you, too. All right, let's do it. Oh, for God's sake. See, a guy like that should just stay inside so we don't have to look at him. Joe, go over there and tell him to get back in his house. Don't worry, I'll take care of it. Joe, you gotta go inside. You're upsetting my dad. Your dad? That's right. He loves me in a way that... Oh, you guys had pizza? Screw you, Peter. You know what? This is over. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not a chance. I like your house better. I got nothing to hold on to when I poop at home. You have no idea how many shower curtains I've ripped down. Now get inside. No, I'm not gonna do that. Oh, yes, you are. Get away from me, you son of a bitch! What the hell? Joe, don't take that from him! Oh, how do you like that? You're getting your ass kicked by a cripple! A helpless spaghetti-legged cripple! What are you doing? You're my son. You can't let yourself get beat up by a guy in a wheelchair. Your son is a guy in a wheelchair. What are you talking about? <sighs> yes. Yes, Dad. It's me. <coughs> Joe! What the hell happened to you? I was shot in the line of duty. <coughs> line of duty. So this is why you haven't called me in all these years? How could I, Dad? You always made fun of handicapped people. The only thing I never understood was... Why? I don't know. I guess I could never stand the thought of something like that happening to me. Or even worse, to someone that I care about. One time my legs fell asleep on the toilet. I had to crawl into the living room and interrupt Lois's book club. That was one of the shower curtains I ripped down. And I suppose deep down, I was afraid. Afraid that if it did happen, I wouldn't be strong enough to handle it. Well, Dad, I can tell you from experience, it's only when your worst fears come true that you get to find out how strong you really are. Then I guess I've got some learning to do. I love you, son. I, I love, love you, you too, too, Dad. Hey, Joe, uh, just one question. Why do you have all those Wizard of Oz plates? Because if I finish my vegetables, I get to see the yellow brick road. All right, you sold me. Now listen, Joe, I'm sorry I treated you like such a jerk. Well, that's okay, Peter. In fact, I gotta say it was a nice thing you did. I'm glad I reconnected with my dad after all these years. Ah, it was my pleasure. There's no more important relationship than... I'm sorry, Cleveland, what the hell is that Toronto Raptors hat? It was my Father's Day present. I hate it. I'm just gonna wear it for a week, then say I lost it. Anyway, thanks for helping me, Peter. Yeah, it all worked out great, Joe. Except I am still missing that one pair of pants. 